Good morning, everyone. How are you feeling today? My name is Andrea and welcome in today's Pilates class. If this is your first time here and you want to do more Pilates with me, press the subscribe button and the bell notification icon so you won't miss any future classes. Today we're going to start in a seated position. So please sit in any comfy position. I'm actually going to sit up on the block so it's a little bit nicer. Lift the chest and then just roll the shoulders backwards a few times. Feel your shoulder stretching. Feel your chest opening. And maybe you can even hear my bones cracking. And roll the shoulders forward. So I'm not sure if you know, but I guess everyone knows next week we're back in the gyms. Are you coming back or are you going to be here with me on YouTube still? Let me know if you want some classes. Let's open the arms, stretch the hands, open the palms, make fists a few times. Yeah, so I will still be uploading the YouTube videos, but not every day, but three times a week. So instead of 21 videos, I'll just upload nine. Oh god, it's a really big difference. <laughs> oh yeah. Make a fist, make fists <laughs> with both hands and just circle your wrists. Feel the nice stretch. One way, then the other way. So yeah, if you don't want to go to the gyms, that's completely fine. I'll be still doing the Zoom classes and I'll be uploading the videos too. <sighs> I got a few messages from me, well, quite a few, <laughs> that you don't want to go back to the gym. I completely understand. I wouldn't be going back if I didn't have to, but I'll do everything for you. So that's one of the things. Let's open the arms and then bring the hands down to the mat. Slide the left hand away from you. Place the right hand to your lower back and just look up. And then look down and just do this, do this few times. Be stretching the neck. And it's a nice side stretch as well. And slowly come back up. This time we're sliding the right hand away, left hand is on the low back, and just look up and down a few times. We're just waking up the back the neck so we can work hard today keep smiling and then slowly back up take a deep breath in make sure the core is strong already and as you exhale i need you to twist to the left and i just stay here if you want to move your head again you don't have to, this is a really nice stretch though. So if you, even if you don't have any tension in your neck or shoulders, it's better to stretch them before you all get in. <laughs> Just a little nice stretch. And slowly come back to the center, lift the chest, take a deep breath in. I'll be smiling. And as you exhale, twist to the right. And again, if you want to move your head, And gently come back to the center. Very good. We're going to uh, do the hard work down on the mat. So when you're ready, you can lie down and I'm changing the block a pillow because I just want to be more comfy. Why not? Why not? We're still at home, we can be as much comfortable as we can. Because once you're back in the gym, you won't have all your pillows and blankets with you. So that's why I really prefer it <laughs> at home. But it's fine, you know life changes so let's keep the knees bent just one more little stretch before the hard work you can relax the arms anywhere you want to and just gently move your knees from side to side so we're just kind of working on the low back and the hips as much as we can and slowly stop the movement i need you to push the low back down tap your belly in I need you to bring the knees up and then feet a little bit higher and try to bring your legs as close towards you as you can. 
Stretch the arms up towards the ceiling and let's just stay here and really try to work with the core and bring the knees close to you. We're just gonna stay. And I can already feel the hips and the core working. Shoulders are still down on the mat for now. Take a deep breath there. Exhale, knees a little bit closer. It's not as easy as it looks. Inhale. Exhale, a little bit closer. No cheating, two more breaths. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale, bring the palms together. Lift the chest, bring the arms from the outside of the left leg. We're staying here, we're still trying to bring the knees closer. We're trying to reach as much as we can. And I'm shaking already. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Two more breaths. Inhale. Exhale. Knees closer. Inhale. Exhale. I think one more. Difficult to count. Inhale. And exhale slowly down. Slowly to the left. I know I'm shaking. I'm dying, but we need to do four more breaths. And that's it. Knees closer. Inhale. Inhale. Exhale. I'm dying here. Two more breaths. Inhale. Closer. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. And slowly back to the center. Slowly down. Hug your knees. Move your knees from side to side. That was good, wasn't it? And then release the knees, bring the feet down. Oh wow, can you feel the hips? And just move your knees from side to side again. Wow. Ooh. <laughs> well done, well done. You're doing something good. Where's the beach body? We need it for the summer. Am I going to get to the beach this year? <laughs> Hopefully, yes. Maybe. Oh, it's just so unpredictable, isn't it? Have you been on holiday? <laughs> I'm not even asking. Okay, keep the knees bent. Push the lower back down, tuck the belly in. Lift the arms up towards the ceiling. Oh no, lower the right hand down. <laughs> Take a deep breath in. As you exhale, lift the left knee up to table to position. Lift the chest, come to the left and try to grab your heel or touch the heel. You don't have to grab it. Inhale down. And exhale again. Can you breathe? Inhale down. Exhale up. Inhale. Inhale. Exhale. Only three more to go. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. <laughs> I can't count. I think this is the last one. And exhale. Very good. Slowly down. And let's relax for a moment. So I hope you felt um, obviously more on the left side, but the whole core, the back, and the leg as well, the arm, because I felt everything. And let's just drop the knees to the right just for a little stretch. We need to do the fast ones in a moment. 
So how was this lockdown? Well, lockdown, it's probably not lockdown anymore for you. But how was the life without the gyms for you? Some of you realize you don't need gyms in your life. Thank you. Uh, and some of you realize that you can't live without the gym. Me personally, if I didn't teach in the gyms, I wouldn't go to the gyms. Like, at all. Like, never. <laughs> I like doing my classes, but you can do the classes without doing the gyms. Like, uh, I started the Taekwondo. Woohoo! My new hobby. I really, really like it. It's a shame I didn't do Wing Chun during lockdown because that's when I had the time. But unfortunately, now I'm not going to have the time. <laughs> okay, let's get back. Oh. <laughs> and I need you to push the low back down. We're going to lift the left leg up, lift the right, um, keep the right arm down, lift the left arm. We're just going to reach and down 16 fast. Times. Good luck. Ready? Keep smiling. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight more. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, and the last one. Oh, well done. Do what you need. Oh, did you hear my knee? Oh, I'm dying. Oh. oh, shake it off, shake it off. Very good. So yeah, the good news is in uh, Venue 360 for Pilates we will have the conference room, it's a huge room, on the stage, loads of space. Unfortunately, other gyms don't have such a big room. <laughs> but you know, what can you do? Okay, ready for the other leg, other side, keep the left. Um, keep the right, left, right arm, so left arm down, right arm up, and I hope I'm right, and then we're going, yeah, we're going to the right. I'm just too excited about this Pilates. Ready? Tuck the belly in. Inhale here. Exhale, lift the right leg and try to touch your ankle. Inhale down. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Only two more to go. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Very good. Slowly down. Ooh, lower the arm. Move your knees. And just gently drop your knees to the left. Have a little stretch. Okay. And slowly come back to the center. Yay! Are you excited about the fast ones? Are you going to really, really feel it? Remember, 
If you're engaging every muscle, you will feel it. If you're not, you can just turn off the video and just do something else. Because there's no point, okay? There's seriously no point if you're not engaging the muscles. Ready? Right arm up, low back down. 16 fast ones. And one, two, three, four, Five, six, low back, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and the last one, well done. Have a little breath, just shake it off. Have a little water if you need it. Ba -da -ba -ba. I hope you're still smiling. There's only a few more minutes of hard work, I promise you. Now, I need you to bend your knees, lift both arms up, drop the shoulders down to the mat. Take a deep breath in. As you exhale, lift the chest and try to touch your knees. You can even come all the way up. It's entirely up to you. Inhale down. Exhale, use the core. If you're not using the core, you will have a neck ache. Inhale down, we don't want to hurt the neck. Exhale, so even if you're here, make sure you're using the core, not the neck. Inhale down. Exhale, feel it. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Two more to go. Inhale down. Exhale up. Inhale. And exhale. Very good. Slowly down and we'll try to do 16 fast ones. You don't have to go all the way up. Ready? And one, two, three, four, use the core, five, six, seven, keep smiling, eight, use the core, one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, and the last one. If you're up, open the knees, lean forward. If you're still down, gently sit up, open the knees, lean forward. Just very gently move from side to side. You can feel the nice stretch through the back. Relax your neck, relax your shoulders. Move well down, you did really, really well. Slowly, gently sit up. Bring the knees together, and just for a little moment, we're going to lie down to our front. So, if you're pregnant, please just skip this part. It's not good for you. <laughs> but I guess you know. Let's lie down, bring the hands on top of each other, keep the feet hips width apart, bring the forehead down, squeeze your bum, tuck the belly in, as you inhale, lift the chest, lift the shoulders, roll the shoulders back and down, 
and exhale, slowly come down. And again, inhale, lift. Exhale, down. Inhale. Exhale, two more. Inhale. Exhale, we stand up now. Inhale, lift, and you can stay here. You can bring the elbows under the shoulders. You can even come up higher. And all I need you to do is to gently twist, look over your one shoulder, come back to the centre and the other side. So even if you're lower, just try to move gently. So it works lower. It works when you're high as well. So just feel the nice stretch through the neck, down to your low back. If you want to stretch a little bit more, you can even bend your knees. It's a little bit uh, more intense for the low back, obviously. And then slowly come back to the center, straighten the legs, gently come down. Slide the hands under the shoulders, push yourself up. All four position. Make sure the hands are under the shoulders, knees are under your hips. As you inhale, roll the shoulders back and down, look up. As you exhale, curl the back, look down, drop the chin to the chest. And again, inhale up. Exhale, curl. <clears throat> Inhale, up. As you exhale, curl the back and slowly sit down into child's pose. You can bring the arms anywhere you want to. Relax as much as you can. Breathe. And slowly, gently sit up. Lift the chest. If you can sit here, sit here. If you need to sit in any other position, please adjust. And I need you to place your right hand of your left knee and stretch the left arm behind you. Look towards your left hand. Take a deep breath in. And exhale. One more breath. Inhale, exhale, slowly come back to the center, roll the shoulders, move your head, and then let's place the left hand over your right knee, reach the right arm behind you, and let's stay here. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Very good. Slowly come back to the center. Move your shoulders, move your head. And then slowly, gently sit down. Well done. Have a little water. Shavasana time is coming. So please get into any comfortable position where you can relax for a little moment. As you know, you can keep the knees bent. Make sure the low back is happy as well. But you can also straighten the legs. Do whatever you need to do. Bring the arms wherever they need to be. And when you're ready, just close your eyes. Smile. And let's just appreciate how we feel after all this hard work because you worked really, really hard today. Well done. So let's enjoy this moment of peace and quiet.
and to slowly turn to move your body again. To start to feel your muscles, start to feel your arms, your legs. Gently move your hands, your feet. You can even move your head from side to side. And then gently bend your knees. You can even hug them if you wish. Move your knees from side to side. Feel your lower back. Make sure it feels good. And then gently roll to one side and push yourself up into any comfy seat position. Keep the eyes still closed just for a little moment and smile. Enjoy how amazing you feel after today's workout. We worked quite hard today, well done. And I hope you feel refreshed, full of energy, and ready to carry on this beautiful day. Let's clap the hands in front of the chest, just to wake us up. Namaste.